Hey, it's Kyle Sullerud, and let me start this video just by showing you the title of the video was not clickbait at all. These are real results from a real AdWords campaign. You can see the bottom campaign here titled Smart Display. 171 clicks, 180,000 impressions, and the cost for that? zero dollars okay zero dollars cost zero dollars per click I have not paid a thing for this traffic now you can compare that to these other uh, these other display campaigns these are just the display campaigns I'm showing in this account um, so a while back we tried a standard display campaign uh, 242 clicks 136,000 impressions that cost $153 um, this wasn't the type of business where I really expected a display campaign to work, but uh, the client wanted to try it anyway. Remarketing, however, is working pretty well. Um, and you can see the results here. The, the average cost per conversion for this account is about $60. For the remarketing, uh, we're at about $22. And not a ton of uh, traffic from that, but uh, it's working nonetheless. So what's going on with this campaign that we're getting all this traffic for free? Well, this is a new type of uh, campaign option that Google is rolling out. It's still in the very early beta stages right now. Most likely you will not be able to do what I'm about to show you. In over a hundred accounts that I am managing, I was only able to set this up in one account okay um, there are a lot of requirements to be able to do this and even if you're meeting those requirements you still probably won't be able to do it you just won't have this option in your account uh, what this is is the option pay for conversions okay basically what we're going to do is set a bid for conversions and we will only pay for the actual conversions if there aren't conversions we won't pay uh, one of the main requirements of this is that you need at least 100 conversions in the last 30 days across your account, or you won't have a chance of being able to set this up. Even if you do have 100 conversions in the last 30 days, there's still a good chance you won't be able to set it up. Um, and my guess is Google's not going to leave this option running for very long because it's going to just be too easy to game the system. Uh, what if you decide to just turn off your conversion tracking now suddenly you're getting all this free traffic because Google has no way to charge you if you're not tracking your conversions so anyway let's assume that you have all the uh, requirements met and Google is going to allow you to set up this option uh, let me show you how that would be done so we'll create a new campaign you need to create a display campaign and then you need to select one of these top options, sales, leads, or website traffic. So I'm gonna select leads, and then you'll need to select smart display campaign, okay? You can enter your website here. Um, the main thing to note is w once you're setting this up, your bidding, okay, needs to focus on conversions. Okay, and if you're setting up the goal for leads, that's the only option it's going to give you is to focus on conversions. Okay, automatically maximize conversions is going to be the only option here. You'd put in a target. So for this account, like I said, the average conversion cost across the account was $60 per conversion. Uh, when I set this up, I set a target CPA of $30. So I used half. Um, figuring that just some of the display conversions aren't going to be as good as the search conversions we're getting for this client. And then down here, okay, this is the option you're probably not going to see, the pay for option. You can see now I'm given the option to pay for conversions. You will probably not have this option. Um, if you do, that's great, but you're probably only going to see the option to pay for clicks. Now, if you do have the option to pay for conversions, um, you'd continue setting this up. Now, this is a smart display campaign, meaning you're basically letting Google set this all up for you. 
which doesn't really matter if you're only going to be paying for conversions anyway. Uh, normally, I wouldn't recommend using too many automated features, if any. You want control over your campaigns, um, but since Google's only going to charge me for conversions, okay, I'm going to go ahead and let them pretty much set this all up for me. Um, you may want to exclude some stuff. Okay, I still excluded a lot of the sensitive content. I pretty much always do that. Um, but other than that, I don't care where Google shows this ad. I'm not going to have to pay until someone converts. Okay, um, you set up the ad here like you normally would, and then you'd create the campaign. Now, you may find even if you are shown this option here to pay for conversions, once you hit create campaign, Google's going to Google's going to put a warning up here and it'll tell you, no, sorry, you can't do that. Okay, nine out of 10 times, what I found anyway in the accounts I looked at, even when I was given this option to pay for conversions, um, I was not even able to create the campaign. So don't get too excited just because you see this option. But if all that looks good, if you're able to pay for conversions and you're able to save the campaign, great you're up and running you're ready to go you're gonna get a ton of traffic um, and you're not going to have to pay until people convert now maybe there's no point to that um, you know what's there's no point to getting traffic if it's not going to convert anyway um, but my my thought is eventually Google might start to find a couple conversions for me, and that's great. If I'm only paying $30 per conversion, I'm more than happy to do that when the average for this account is $60 per conversion. Hey, so quick update. We are a few more days into the campaign, and you can see Google is finding some conversions for me now. I'm paying $30 per conversion, which is exactly what I was bidding. And that's translating into 39 cents to click. Still getting a lot of impressions and a good amount of clicks from the campaign. So I'm curious to see what happens with this, if they can keep learning and figuring out how to get more conversions for the campaign. Google certainly has a very sophisticated AI. So if any algorithms can figure this out, it's Google's algorithms. Um, but I'm going to wait and see. Since I'm only paying for a conversion, um, I'm happy to, to let this run and um, happy to increase the budget if they keep finding conversions for $30 each. I'm curious to hear what some of you are finding. Since I'm only able to test this in one account, um, it'd be nice to see uh, what some other people are experiencing. If you're able to run this pay for conversion model in your account, please give it a try. Leave a comment. Let me know what's happening with that. I'm really curious to see what your experience is. Thanks for watching this video. Go ahead and subscribe if you want to see more from me, and I will talk to you later.